Hello. In this video, we'll take a quick look at how to ensure AOG starts up and connects to your board correctly. Here, the board is off, and we don't have it linked to the tablet with the cable at all. To review, AOG needs to have two connections to work properly. It must have a network cable linked between the tablet and the board. And if you are using RTK, you will also need a Wi-Fi connection to a mobile hotspot, such as your phone. So, let's open AOG and we'll see that straight away, we have a problem. AgIO, the program that talks to the board in AOG, says it cannot reach our RTK provider and when it switches to AOG, we have a spinning logo. So let's switch back to AgIO by pressing the green button at lower left. First of all, our three icons for IMU, Steer and GPS aren't green. And in this case of course, we expect it because the board isn't on, nor is it wired to our tablet. Also, we can see we have only one network showing, the 127.0.0.1 line, but this is no use to us. So, the first thing to ensure you've done is enabled mobile hotspot on your phone. We can temporarily hide AOG by pressing the yellow underline at top right. Then, we'll press the little globe icon at the bottom right of the screen and join our mobile hotspot network. Straight away we can see that AgIO has noticed this network becoming available and brought up an address of 192.168.217.231 yours will be different, but the important thing is it has an address. A good tip is to make sure your hotspot is available before you even power the tablet on. Next, we'll power up our steer board and make sure the network cable is plugged into our tablet. Usually, you'll just leave the cable in, but perhaps if you have the tablet out of the tractor, you'll need to ensure it is securely inserted. After a moment, you'll notice the GPS, steer and IMU icons illuminate. If for any reason the IMU stays off while the other two are on, just power the board off and on and try again. Also, you'll see that AgIO has now noticed your other network become available, the 192.168.5.5 line. And at this point, you are now ready to go. However, if you return to AgOpen GPS by pressing the green icon at bottom right, You'll notice the icon is possibly still rotating and you have Agio with a question mark. But everything looks okay in Agio. This is because you've just started the system and it's waiting to get a GPS fix. Give it a moment and it should come to life. And you're good to go. And that's it for this video. If we missed anything, let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and watch the playlist regularly for new additions. See you next time.